Welcome back. Get ready to dive into the world of tech with MA Tech. Bringing you the latest updates, reviews, and insights in just a few seconds. Today, we're diving into the future, exploring everything leaked and speculated about the 2024 iPhones. Months before the official reveal, insiders have already started painting a picture of what Apple is planning. Let's uncover the secrets together. First up, the design changes. According to leaks, Apple is taking a bold step in redefining the iPhone's aesthetics. Expect slimmer bezels, a more robust frame, and possibly, the introduction of new materials that make the phone lighter yet stronger. Every detail promises to enhance your device's look and feel. What about the features? Leakers hint at groundbreaking technology that could change how we use our phones. From enhanced AR capabilities to smarter, more intuitive AI, the next iPhone is gearing up to be not just a phone, but a next-gen gadget. Plus, there's talk about an all-new camera system that could take mobile photography to professional levels. Performance-wise, insiders are buzzing about a new chip that redefines speed and efficiency. Imagine faster processing, more seamless multitasking, and an overall smoother experience. Battery life is also expected to get a significant boost, ensuring your phone keeps up with your busy lifestyle. Apple's commitment to sustainability continues to be a priority. The 2024 models might feature eco-friendly materials and more efficient energy use. This step not only benefits the planet but also aligns with the growing demand for responsible tech. Let's talk numbers. While pricing remains speculative, the strategy might include offering a range of models to cater to different budgets. Insiders suggest Apple is considering market feedback to balance premium features with affordability. Also, we'll discuss potential release dates and how to prepare for the launch. Although we're still months away, the excitement is palpable. These early leaks paint a promising picture of the 2024 iPhones, blending innovation with user-centric improvements. What feature are you most excited about? A newly leaked case design has sparked rumors of a feature that could change how we use our iPhones. Let's dive into the details and speculate on what this could mean for Apple enthusiasts. Uncover the powerhouse within the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max. This comprehensive analysis looks into the new chipset's capabilities, RAM upgrades, and the software optimization that delivers seamless performance. Whether you're a gamer seeking the ultimate mobile gaming experience, a professional relying on heavy multitasking, or someone who craves efficiency, find out how these models stand up to the demand. Navigating the premium pricing of the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max, we dissect the value proposition offered by these high-end models. Analyzing the cost relative to the technological advancements and comparing it with previous generations, this chapter aims to provide you with a clear perspective on the investment required for these flagship devices. Marking the calendar for the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max release. This essential segment offers all the details on launch dates, pre-order windows, and availability. Tips on securing your device amidst high demand are also shared ensuring you're well prepared to be among the first to experience Apple's latest innovation. Concluding our deep dive, we reflect on the impact of the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max on the smartphone market and consumer expectations. Evaluating whether the upgrades justify an early switch and discussing the potential these devices have to shape the future of mobile technology. Here's what we know. A leaked case design, not officially from Apple but from a source with a solid track record, Sonny Dixon, hints at something intriguing. The case shows a clear cutout on the right side, just beneath the power button. This isn't just any cutout. It's speculated to be for a brand new feature on the iPhone 16 Pro, the capture button. Let's break down the design elements based on this leak. The power button is covered with a rubber cap, an interesting choice, while the alleged capture button has its own special cutout. This design choice could suggest enhanced functionality or a different way of interacting with the device. Why the distinction? And how could this new button transform our user experience? Now, onto the fun part, speculation. If the iPhone 16 Pro includes a capture button, what would its purpose be? A dedicated camera button for quick photo and video capture? Or could it serve a broader range of functions, like triggering specific apps or actions? 
Let's explore the possibilities and what they could mean for future iPhone interactions. Introducing a new button on the iPhone is no small decision. How could this impact the way we use our phones daily? Could we see improvements in accessibility, quicker camera access, or even new features tied specifically to this button? We'll discuss the potential benefits and drawbacks of such a design choice. While we're still in the realm of speculation, the idea of a capture button on the iPhone 16 Pro is undeniably exciting. It shows Apple's commitment to innovation and possibly hints at new directions for iPhone usability. But what do you think? Is this a game changer or just a gimmick? Big news for Apple fans. It's been reported that the upcoming iPhone 16 Pros will feature a brand new capture button alongside the existing action button. This marks a significant shift in Apple's design approach. Today, we're unpacking everything we know about this feature and what it means for you. Earlier this month, insiders revealed Apple's plans to add a capture button to the iPhone 16 Pro models. Positioned to enhance photography and video recording, this button aims to replicate the soft shutter button found on traditional cameras. With a half press for focusing and a full press for taking photos or continuous shots, it's designed for the photography enthusiast in all of us. Incorporating a physical capture button is quite the departure from Apple's typical minimalistic design. Known for their sleek and button-free aesthetics, this addition is a nod towards enhancing user experience with tactile feedback. But why this change now, and how does it align with Apple's vision for the future of the iPhone? Physical camera buttons aren't new to smartphones. Sony, for instance, included a shutter button in some of its models. However, those were criticized for being slim and not very user-friendly. Apple's attempt seems to be about getting it right, making the capture button functional and satisfying to use. Let's dive into how Apple's approach might differ and what it means for photography on the iPhone. The introduction of the capture button could revolutionize how we capture moments on our iPhones. By offering more precise control over focusing and shooting, Apple is catering to both professional photographers and everyday users looking for that perfect shot. We'll explore the potential benefits and drawbacks of this feature, including its impact on the overall user experience. This move by Apple has certainly sparked a conversation. What do you think about the addition of a capture button? Is it a welcome innovation or an unnecessary complication? Share your thoughts in the comments below. We love hearing from you and engaging in the discussion about what makes the perfect smartphone experience. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more tech content. See you next time on MA Tech.